Hello everybody, welcome to Mr. GFX. Today we are going to speak about motion graphic in Unreal Engine and how to create this motion and how to create this shape with uh, Unreal Engine from A to Z. Uh, if this is the first time at my channel, don't forget to subscribe for my channel and like for my video and let's get started. First of all, we need to enable motion design. Okay, from here, edit, plugin, and motion. So we will see here motion design. Okay, enable it and restart Unreal and open it again. So this is a very important. After that, the second step, we need to go to file, new level and choose basic level. Now we need to create our uh, model. From here, we will see here uh, this menu, it shows modeling. After that, we will see here uh, box and cylinder. So now we need to uh, create cylinder. So now we are going to uh, choose cylinder. So if you look here, we have around uh, slice. Okay, we need to make this one decrease it to be six angle like that. Okay, and accept. So now what we are going to do now, we need to uh, duplicate this one. Okay, Alt from keyboard and come here and uh, R from keyboard, scale it a little bit. Okay, come, put it here. Now, after that, Alt again, put this one to be here. Okay, save your project. Make sure you save your project. Mr. GFX01, save. Okay, so now we have this one and we need to add material for this mesh. Okay, content, come here, right click and choose material and choose material. Okay, double click on it. And three, number three from keyboard. Okay, connect this one and choose your color. Okay. And press one, number one from keyboard. Okay, come here and okay, this one convert to parameter and we will make it metallic and max one. Okay, copy paste copy and paste okay so now we have connected this one now we have metallic specular and roughness okay so this one and metallic and specular rename it to be specular and this one connected with roughness roughness okay now apply save close now uh, you can connect this one here or you can right click and create an instance because we need to add two color but go to this one to change your color convert to parameter okay now save and right click create an instance material now we can add this one but we need to add specular double click enable this one okay specular oh nice and maybe we can make roughness like that or metallic to be like this color save close so now we can uh, create another one right click create an instance what's this one here double click and uh, choose another color for example uh, this one maybe and uh, make uh, metallic and okay so nice maybe we can make it different color or you can choose a new one from those like that yeah you can choose anyone uh, as you like but this is just test Okay, so now we have this one. Second step, now we need to merge all of this mesh to be one actor. Okay, actor here, we will see here. 
merge actor okay merge and we will see this one to be test zero one okay so delete all of them okay and go to motion design motion design then I can drop this one here and uh, remote put it here after that we need to uh, go to actor and choose cloner okay click here so now we have uh, our uh, cloner if you look here in cloner we will see here clone and the foot cube okay we need to insert we need to insert our uh, cube here so now we have this one okay just we need to drag and drop this one to be in this area drag and drop so now but we need to delete this default cube from here okay so now we have this nice uh, cube what we are going to do now we need to uh, arrange our uh, shape for this one uh, come here location reset this one and rotation reset it to be like that and come here uh, if you look here cloner we will see here in this area grid okay you can choose line uh, and uh, grid and cylinder okay as you like but we need now we need to choose honeycomb okay now we have this one and we need to make it 50 50 okay 50 50 by 50 nice and we need to make uh, this offset to be near uh, and uh, with space make it near from each other like that so we need to add any animation for uh, this one uh, if you look here now um, in this area we will see a spawn linked effector click here okay if you look here now we have this one effector you can move this one but what we are going to do uh, we need to increase this value to be like that okay and radius to be like that okay or decrease it a lot uh, or you can decrease it so if you look here now we have nice shape but we don't need to do that now unbound and choose this one to be noise field okay uh, when you choose this one okay this is by default when you choose noise field it will appear this menu location and scale and so uh, no uh, now we need to uh, choose this one x y z so we need to choose this one to be z okay so increase this value to be like that and we will make a frequency to be a little bit and the ban it will be like that okay so increase it a little bit and the value okay nice increase it a little bit nice and frequency this is a speed okay what we can decrease it a little bit okay maybe we can make it nice okay our our wave and the so now what we are going to do now we need to go to cloner again and insert spawn link effector again so if you look here this is our effector number two now look but we need to insert to make this value to be more than this one offset look now this is our offset and make this radius to be uh, a little bit large okay to be like that 
now if you look here after that we need to create our uh, camera now from here uh, if you go to this area and choose scene camera so drag and drop this one and insert it here and so now we have this okay after that we uh, can uh, choose this one effector number two and add it here in this area so now if you look here um, we can add here transform transform okay so this is first one and after that we can uh, now we need to select show by by second show frame as second and this is okay we need to make this one to be 10 second okay So, uh, increase this camera a little bit. Okay. Now, choose selector, effector number two, and put it here. Okay. And put it here now, if you look here. Now we need to make our camera to put it here. This first one. and camera make first key after that press F here okay and insert it here again so look But maybe we can uh, play with uh, with this uh, material uh, reflect. Okay, so we can choose this one, our mesh, and go to material. Play with material here. Inca increase this area. Maybe maybe we can put the. Okay. I think it will be nice. Okay, here. Now starts. now this is the time for uh, render you can render uh, this sequence okay uh, we will explain the render in another uh, video if you like this video don't forget to subscribe for my channel and like for my video see you in the next video take care assalamu alaikum